Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. Welcome back. It's the final episode of the series. Been emotional. Hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, we're going to jump straight in. We're actually where we left off in the last video, to be honest. Uh, we've come out of Quantum. We made it back to Microtech. We're just outside. We're going to go and have a look at our salvaging contracts. And yes, now you can see we have the 50k contracts. These are big contracts. This is a retaliator. Vanguard Sentinel, uh, but this one's Arc L1, Crew L5, L L1. We're looking, we're looking for. Maybe they don't have one. Oh, Mick L1. There we go. We're actually there right now. Mick L1. So an Aegis Vanguard. All right. 50,000, 50,000. There we go. We just paid out 50k. There's our contract. Oh, well, we're not even that far from it. Let's go. Let's see what we can do within an hour, shall we? So let's uh, get our speed going. We've got everything we need right now. I'm excited. Let's see what we can do in an hour. Okay. We've got some speed going here. Make sure there's nothing we're going to hit. We're going to have to start thinking about slowing down soon. Ah, maybe in a minute. This is only where we get to the salvage claim. Once we get close, it's going to tell us where we actually need to go. So we're going to adjust course. We probably have about another 10k to go from this. Yep, there we go. That is still going to come by really, really quickly. So we are going to try our best to stop. And we're going to power the other way with boost. There we go. And you can see the blue marker coming back. That means we're now moving that direction. We'll get a nice stop going on. All right, let's go check out our ship, shall we? Go see what we won. 50k, what does 50k get us? All right, well, we can turn the lights on. Get a bit close up. I kind of feel like the first thing we need to do here. What you don't want to do is you don't want to hit this. Is there any... I'm assuming there's a cargo bay in this. It must be, right? Let's have a look. We'll head outside. There must be a cargo bay. Do I have my gear on me? Yes, I do. Alright, we're good to go. We'll open the door. Alright. Ramp access. Ooh. Did say ramp access. Not ramp access is there. I haven't been in this ship before. Don't know it that well. Okay. Yeah. There's nothing in there. There's no light. Huh. Really? There's no cargo in this ship. Hmm. I don't know this ship, so... Huh. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really look like there's much 
place of cargo in here. It's more of a fighter, isn't it? I don't think it was that good of a purchase, really, was it? Maybe the weapons are worth something? It's got some guns on it, right? The Vanguard Warden. Let's just have a quick check, shall we? Go to vehicles. All vehicles. Just type in. The Vanguard Warden. $260 to buy that? Jeez. Right in the game. Hold on. No SCU. Okay. I mean, it's just about what it's got on it, right? The turrets, the weapons, the missiles. I don't know if that was a good purchase or not, to be honest. Same 50k for this. Well, we can grab this. And then we can grab these. We can pull these off like so. I don't know if they're going to be worth anything. I really don't. We can detach them like so. Underneath we'll be able to get the missiles off, but again... I don't really know if they're going to be worth anything. There's the missiles there and there. There's a cannon. Wow, and there's also these cannons as well. They're tiny, but... Hmm. Alright. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll, we'll take this. do is open up the back ramp and then we can simply just grab the cannon throw it in there I mean it's huge to be fair oh didn't quite go according to plan Huh? Did that just glitch through the floor? And it just glitched through the floor. I mean, okay. Sure. Okay. <laughs> um, let's just start salvaging, shall we? All right, we're going to go into salvaging mode. Let's also turn the lights on so we can see what we're doing. It's a nice ship, but it's not really that big. I kind of feel like we were robbed just then but we have the two abrade scraper modules and at least we can start using these oh. try again
these should work nicely. I like putting them together. I mean, you can actually do them individually and go in different directions with them, but I kind of like to do it like this. I reckon I'm hitting that gun, you know. It's got to be there. I kind of feel like that gun's got to be worth something on this ship. Otherwise, why, why give us this ship? It's not a great ship. There's not a lot of surface area. Knowing that we're going to get about 15k per box, we're going to need to get four boxes to be in profit. Oh, we've already got two boxes, so yeah. And we're going to be in profit from this. Maybe it just doesn't need to be that big, or maybe it's bigger than I thought. Nice and peaceful. So don't forget we've got both sides. This is just one side of it. And having that second abraid has made a big difference. We're flying through this at the moment. Uh, I've got that stuff at the front. Nice and easy. I'll just grab all of that. So three point two already. Can just be four and we're gonna break even, so well four be profit. And we've just about done that now, so that's that's profitable now. So we're going to make about 50k off of this. It's not even taking us that long to do it. We really only want the RMC at the moment. We don't want anything else. Okay, let's about that from there. Nice, very clean, very easy. Do this bit here. Now we can break this down afterwards, but I, don't, I really don't want the construction materials. And I'm kind of wondering how many boxes we get out of this. We can store a total if we're really careful of about 27 boxes in here, so be interesting to know what we can do. And also how long it takes, we're at 15 minutes already. That that sound. Really therapeutic. I'm zone out listening to that. Kind of white noise hum. Alright, that's pretty much all of that part. That's pretty much all of that part of the ship. Yep, looking good. Let's go and do the other side.
So you do the front bit while I'm going round it. Okay. Got a little bit of girth, but it's all. We'll try and do the sides the best we can. We go around. Now we don't want to waste too much time here. Like it's good to do this, but okay, we'll grab all of that. And six already, so decent bit of profit. that bit that's fine start from here decent ships these would be great for fighting with but uh yeah not so good now this one's seen better days all right let's uh spin underneath we could have belly a little bit Clean all this stuff off of it. Contract complete. Right, so that considers it to be done. Well, to be honest, there's still so much more we can do from this. I don't think we're anywhere near complete just yet. I rip all of this off. All of this here as well. It's coming off so easy. Working over to the last part here. We're talking about 20 minutes now. About 20 minutes to do this. And this was a 50k contract that has paid us, I would say, about 50k. So we've made about 50k in about 20 minutes. They're not the most profitable job we could do. But a nice chill one nonetheless. And the next stage we have on us at the moment is to be able to lift on W and then we're going to It goes. We'll get that fracturing. Boom. It almost looks like we get it again now, it's fractured.
we almost get to do it twice. Okay. It looks like we're getting like double the RMC from Fracture in it there. That's nice. This has all become available again. Now, I don't know if that's a bug or not. Or a feature. Hard to say at this stage. We're up to 8.3. I kind of want to get up to 10, because then that's going to be a 100k profit. That'll be nice. Now I have to think about when we're trading gold and what we're making for that. Doing those runs. And we were making about 170k in about 20 minutes. Right now we're about 20 minutes in. And we've made... Not even 100k. But definitely not as profitable. Definitely not as profitable as what we were doing before. In terms of like efficiency. Still nice. Very chilled. We haven't got to stress and worry. We haven't got to risk. We haven't had to spend half a million to do this. We haven't got to run back and forth to New Babbage. That's nice. Also, sometimes on these ships, you can get bits inside them as well. So we could pick up Contanium or other things that we can sell inside, and they can be worth quite a lot of money. So there can definitely be a lot of profit in these ships, but I guess it depends on how long it takes. Yeah, very nice so far. Nice and chilled and relaxed. Grab that bit there. Alright, so now we can go and do this side. Absolutely breaking this ship down. Into the bottom side of it. I don't know if again. I, I just don't know if the guns are going to be worth anything. But we don't going to have any space for the weapons anyway, so we're not going to take them on board. It's fine. We're going to be full of boxes, and we're also not going to mulch this and break it down. We haven't got the space for that either. Today is about 10 SCU. At this stage, we need about 12 SCU to be 100k profit. No, I'm sorry, 10. 10 SCU. 10 SCU would be 100k profit. There we go, we've made about 100k in 25 minutes. Nice. It was good. There's so much of this to do.
This is surprising. I did not realise there was that, that much to this. But yeah, this is nice. Also, considering it's taken us 25 minutes, if we're doing a, an illegal one and we've only got half an hour, we'd also have to get out and get the boxes, so however long that takes. Alright, that's pretty much it. Not really much left for this ship. I think that's us. I could sit there and split hairs about getting perfect, but... Eh. I really don't think I need to. I've pretty much got most of what's available. I'm going to try and get that 11th box out. I'm at 10.9 right now. I think this bit here is going to get me up to 10. 11, sorry. Or maybe it won't. But this bit definitely will. There we go, we're up to 11 now. Perfect. All right, contract complete. Let's uh, have a look. What are the contracts we have in the area? Salvage missions. Again, going down, looking for the 50Ks on the bottom. Scrolling up. We see this one. Nikhil 2. Oh, 400 I salvage. All right, we'll do that. That's the same place. We're always going for the Mikhail 2s. Hopefully not that far from where we are. Cool. I want to hit that. Well, it's actually a bit of a distance away, so let's uh, swap that over. And then let's... Uh, It says routing not available. That's not good. Wait, what? Oh, because it's on Microtech. Okay. There we go. Shouldn't take us that long to get there. Given that we've got a new quantum drive anyway. We're looking at... Two minutes to OM4 and then two minutes to MGTOW. So, four minutes to get there. That's cool. Well, while we're traveling, it's going to take a couple of minutes. So, we can simply come downstairs. We've got two minutes. So, a bit of time. We may as well head downstairs. We're in Quantum, so it's all good. But we can just... Yeah, look at that. Recycle materials, 10.35, perfect. Get that out. Nice. Perfect. I'm just going to start these ones first. I'm going to work my way back. As I said, we've got two minutes, so we'll do this. Fill these up. Once this is done, we'll go back up. Two minutes to the next place.
Well, what? Did, that Did we just lose a box? Where did that go? Huh. Still 4.3 to go. this one off. Oh, there's already one there. Oh, wait, there's not. Is there one there? Oh, there is one there. Didn't even know they got there. Okay. Crazy. Convey belt is clear. There we go. head back up now. That's definitely taking us more than two minutes, but that's all good. Ah, at least we did what we needed to do. Thirty two minutes in. You definitely need a second person with this. That way you can... They can come and meet you, unload. And then they can go and sell it while you're continuing to go. And salvage more. Makes sense as a two-man job. So while I'm here, it's going to take me two minutes anyway. I'm going to move that last spot. No. Then they've got two there, two there, two there, two there. Then one come up there. Nice. Oh. Easy. This is much better. They've really improved this. It was horrible before. You had to come down every single bot. Now at least you could fit a load in the hopper. It's, I feel like they've really improved this from when I last used it. I used it when it first came out, before it was even available in game. When I when I first used this, you couldn't you couldn't rent it. You had to buy it. So I bought it. I'll be honest, I refunded it. <laughs> I only bought it to, to, to use it for that patch, and then I got a refund on it. Because um, I can get it in a game now. Alright, let's get over here. What a distance we need to go. Quantum drive is now off. Alright, 40 kilometers to go to the salvage claim. Think we don't want to. Okay. 
second. 1050. That's some speed we got going. But we're gonna find stuff if we're gonna. Alright. So we can start slowing down. Oh my god, we're gonna have to start slowing down. I don't want to hit this. Our new salvage. Let's go and see if there's anything inside. We gotta make sure you don't hit them. That's the key. We could just scan it, although I don't know what the scan button is, so let me just go to options, uh, keybinds. Should be a button for scan. Mm -mm -mm. I'm sure there's a button for scan. I cannot see it though. We should definitely set a button for scan. Let's do that right now. What buttons are not being used? On the keyboard, a mouse, button. I guess button F3 is not being used. Okay, we'll use that. Or Alt and Z. I guess I can use Alt and Z. All right, we'll do that. Oh, no, look. Scan mode toggle. V. Scan mode toggle V. So, what is V? Ah. There we go. We are scanning it. Is there anything inside? Going to tell us in the top right. Yes, cargo, look at that. Gold. Con oh, we've got some containium in here and we've got some gold. Five SE of scrap. Three of iron. One of processed food. I mean, I think we just take the containium maybe. I think we take all of it, but... All right, nice. Let's do this. We found some cargo. So, we're going to have to... Oh. What does he want? Stop. Stop. Okay. He's telling us to wait because he's going to scan us. There we go. It remains stationary scan in progress. We have nothing bad on us. So we're okay. We're doing nothing wrong. Yeah, our scan's complete. get a little bit closer and then I'm actually going to go alongside him look a decent sized ship that'll do we don't want to spend too long doing this so let's just head outside we've got to grab them boxes in and then we'll fill up the hoppers and then we're good to go back so that's us there's nothing illegal in there which is nice sometimes if there's illegal stuff in there and it gets scanned there's a lot of scans at these we have to be careful of that open the doors cargo bite A 
open the cargo boat. Look at that. Down it comes. Oh, that looks beautiful. Okay. Now, I don't know what is what. We're not going to fit all of that in, unfortunately. And some of it's not even worth anything. There's the Quantanium. I'm pretty, pretty certain that's the Quantanium right there. Ah. Huh. I mean, I guess... I guess we're going to have to take it all, right? Oh, it says it on it. Scrap. Ah, it even tells you now what it is. It never used to do that. Amazing. So what I need to do now, just very quickly, is I need to go back to this. I need to go to resources, qualities, and I need to find out how much scrap cost or is worth. Sell price. Is that it? Scrap 180. Really? What, per SEU? No, that can't be. It is. Per SEU? Wow. Crap, so cheap. All right, so let's look at Quantanium, shall we? Quantanium. 23,000 for that. That Quantanium is worth 23 grand, so that's a great find. Uh, what else did we have? We had iron. We're going to leave the scrap. Iron. No, not worth anything. So we'll leave the iron. Uh, what was the other one? It was food. Processed food. Not worth anything. Okay. So the only thing we really want to take out of that is the quantanium. Oh, and there was a gold as well. We'll take the gold, obviously. So we'll leave that. Scrap, we'll leave that. The iron, we'll leave that. Yeah, we're not really interested in those. This one should be the Quantanium, it is. Uh, we'll take this one. Oh, we've lost the box. So let's... Uh, Let's be very careful about this. Oh, let's be very careful about this container. You can go in there like so. In this one. You can go there, just like that. Alright, what's this one? Gold, yeah, we'll take that. You. Oh, there's two gold. Nice. We'll take both gold. Need to work on my... Um, there we go. Okay. Oh no, that's iron, don't want that. Processed food, don't want that. Crap, don't want that. And that's iron as well, don't want that. Alright, just the two boxes for us. The rest of that can stay there, we don't care for it. Close that. We'll that. I definitely said we'll close. Oh my god. There we go. Stay in there and we can go and carry on. Alright. So some of these can be profitable. You know, we just picked up. I don't know what gold's selling for at the moment, but. Let's have a quick look at gold.
seven gold. Okay, so about 30k there. Yep, I think 30k there's a decent chunk. No, 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 no. We've... Okay, what we don't want to do is we don't want to... No. Okay. Press M, and away we go. Nice, easy ship breakdown as well. Beautiful. I think we're going to make some decent money here, you know. So we can fill the depot up before we go back as well. So we can put the boxes in the back, but we can also go back with a full depot as well. So this is going to be a decent run, I think. We have 15 minutes to clear this. It doesn't need to be perfect. Not going to worry about getting every single bit of it. We can definitely get the most. So yeah, 50k contracts and 50. We make back at least 100k on it. 200k an hour, plus anything else, roughly. Yeah, I mean, and it's quite chill. It's nice and relaxing. And we don't have the, the risk, you know. We're making 200k. We're only risking 100k. Obviously, we're making a lot more trading, but you have to think that in order to do that, there's just a lot of risk. A lot more risk, even. So I hope you've enjoyed this series. I hope it's been useful for you. I will do another one very soon. We'll wait for the next patch. And we'll start again. I don't know if the depot is going to be any good next time because we're not going to have local storage. That might not work. That was definitely a good start for us. And also the additional time it's going to take, given the fact that we're going to have to move everything manually. So I think we can probably move these apart slightly. So they're like close to each other, but not on top of each other. Maybe that'll work a bit better. Might cover more space. Get the nose off of this. Such a beautiful looking ship, but... We we just broke even. Well, we're in profit now, sorry. Yeah, I think maybe if we keep them on top of each other, kind of concentrates that beam into one place, breaks through that area twice as quick. Nice. Not really bothered about the side bit, but we'll just give it a little once over. The 
Contanium was definitely a good find. Kind of thinking, what if we find one that's got like three or four Contanium on it? That's going to be a really good win. We're not bothering with the guns or anything like that. I don't think there's any point, to be honest. Oh, there's actually none. None of that hole can be harvested. This bit can, though. Alright, so time-wise we're on 50 minutes. Almost done the first run through, we've got one more to go after this obviously when we fracture. up. But just a nice chill gameplay, easy way to make money, no real risk here. And if you can get a team together, next step up from this is going to be the... You've got the uh, the Vulture here. And then the Reclaimery. But that's going to require more than one person. But that's pretty awesome when you get onto that. Because uh, you can have like multiple points where you're salvaging. Like you've got two arms on the left and the right. And all the boxes just drop in the middle so you have one in the cargo. So... Yeah, like three men on that ship makes it really nice. You don't even need two on this anymore. I used to think you did. Well, you did used to need two on this, but you can you can definitely solo this now. Nice, it's easy. I would definitely like to have like a cutlass black with me though. They can go and get all the cargo as you start stripping, and as you dump, and then they can dump all your boxes out the back to empty your depots out. You can just keep stripping. They can load up all of this into their ship. Kind of makes it a bit easier. All right, I am not worried about this being perfect. So I think I'm going to call that there. And I'm sure I can keep getting more, but all right, let's do this. Oh, is it going to do that at the same time? Is it going to break it? Okay, now I have to press the button to do that. Okay, so are you going to break? Do I need to... Well, maybe I can't break this one. Huh. Maybe I can't break this. Is it too big? I think this might be too big to break. Where is it? No, it's going. Just took a while. Oh, 
Oof. Gonna fracture it. We're at 56 minutes. We have to get back and sell it yet, though. That is taking some time. Let's go again. Really keen to see what we actually bank on this run. But it also feels nicer as well, whilst uh, transporting gears are alright, it's very boring, a lot of running about doing the same thing. This is, I guess, nice and distracting. Quite therapeutic in a way. But that sound is uh, hypnotizing. Maybe I'll fill this up. This is two fifty K contracts that we did. We spent a hundred. First one obviously had no cargo, second one did. Yeah, we got 10 from the last one. If we, I don't even know if we're going to get 10 from this one. Maybe not. But then I'm also not being as icky as I was for the last one. to do now and then I'm pretty much done there's a couple of smaller bits but I think this is mostly it will I get 10 out of it though that's the question I think we might we might just Put it eight point three right now. So we can actually we can actually go and do another one, I reckon. I'm not going to, but 
I think you could probably get free runs out of this. Where you have to go back, which is nice. Almost on nine. Eight point nine. I want to see nine before we. I'd like to see nine in a bit before we finish this side because this is the biggest part now. And if we're going to break ten, I really think we're going to break it here. I'm not going to penny pinch and get every last detail, but we are. There you go. Nine point one. That's good. So much here I didn't pick up. Right. I'm just doing this because if I can get to that 10 point, that's 20 I've got. Out of the two ship, 10 each. And that feels pretty solid. I think I'm going to struggle. Oh no, there's a whole section here I missed. Nice. Yeah, this is this is going to take me up to 10. Nice. Perfect. Run it back nice and slow. We're on the hour mark now. We do have to go and sell it though. like this just isn't giving me anything I'm still stuck on 9.5 maybe the fracture gives you less or something I don't know there are guns on here but eh, I really can't bother to take them off Point six. I really want to get that ten out of this. And that doesn't matter because I can keep something now. I don't have to. Doesn't have to be a box, does it? Yeah. Okay. I think we're good. Is there any lot I left here? I guess there's all this bit here. Seem like it counts as any. That bit all seems like it was got. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we pretty much stripped this down. Not really much left. Oh. Cool. Happy days. All right, let's go, Microtech. We're done. Uh, down to New Babbage. Weird. Let's uh, turn that off. Try that again. I can't access my watch. 
Huh, strange. Let's see. Yeah, maybe if I move somewhere. Maybe now. Maybe if I get up. Huh. Can't access my watch, which is weird. My Moby glass isn't working. Okay, nice. I think I was just maybe zoomed in too much. Need the ship for routing, right? So I have to be sat down. And if I sit down, I can't see anything. Interesting. Maybe it's fixed it. There we go. Alright, new Babbage, please. Perfect. Let's grab that quantum travel and away we go. Straight to Microtech. So we're an hour and five in. Mm, not too bad. It'll probably be like one hour twenty by the time we sell it. It could have been a bit quicker, I guess. But overall, can't complain. Okay, how long is that going to take to travel there? Two minutes. That's fine. We can do that. So the question I have now is, can I sell all of my stuff? Can you sell cargo that is not on a grid? that up. I'll do that in a minute when we get back. But it should hopefully work. I don't think it has to be on the cargo grid. I think it will still accept it if not. Whether that changes in the future or... It never used to be that way. And we'll see how it looks. Alright, where's New Babbage? I have to be careful when I go in here. I don't want to crash. That would be a horrible, horrible end to the season. Straight to the spaceport. Hopefully, in the next time I record this, they'll have fixed that. Beautiful. I don't know why they put it on the ceiling. It's been around, so it's on the floor. Nice. Let's go. Wait, hold on. Oh, over there. <laughs> My bad. Right, in we go.
Now in my defense, the reason I've run out of quantanium or for the quantum fuel has been because I did come back from Hurston. This wasn't only like pottering around here. Moving really slow. But looking really good. I mean, the key here when we get inside is if we can sell the containium, then we know it works. That is not on the grid. One more landing to go. And we're back to where we started. Let's start to head down a little bit. Still quite a long way to go. Hopefully. Please proceed to assign landing bay. That request is I think as done. soon as they tell you to proceed, they should show you. Do you know where you're going? Speed down. Do a little bit more. Okay, get that landing gear down. Glide into the hangar, nice and easy. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Bit foggy, but we're all good. Come on. Really annoying lens flare going on there. Nice. No. There. <laughs> there we go. And engine off. And off we get. Done. Oh, sir. Let's go stick this in storage. And let's go and sell and see how did we end up. Now that we have nothing left to spend as well. The profits we made were good, but we had to keep renting that ship to get them. Now we don't have to do that anymore. Right, we're also going to claim the Aurora. Your insurance claim has been safely Just so it's here. And that's us. Look at that. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. The, uh, the set design team. Incredible job with the locations. The planets feel amazing. The locations feel amazing. The AI is getting better. The server's getting better. These are the cargo storages that are coming in for the next patch. They're all offline for maintenance right now. But they're gonna be gonna be here soon. They should be getting tested next week, I believe. I don't know how long that testing's gonna take. 
Uh, but I'm looking forward to being able to share that with you. Here's the train. Perfect. We're good. Very good. So in terms of money, we've got, <laughs> we've got 13k, 13k, so we've spent 100k, we've got 13k left. I don't know how much we've made, but we've got quite a bit. I mean, we should have made about, we should have about 300k really. I mean, I don't think we have, but 300k would be nice. Hello, Mr. Hill. We're looking about an hour, 20 minutes total from when we started to when we finished. We were able to do two ship, pretty scrape. Plus a cargo transfer of what was valuable and worth taking anyway. We didn't quite fill up the vulture, but we nearly did. Like we wouldn't have had enough space to do another one. We could have broken even on another one, but we wouldn't have made much profit. Beautiful day. Should be able to tell everything I believe here. Maybe not. Yeah, we can. The gold, the quantanium, the IMC. We can sell it all here. Yeah, we can. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Let's have a look. The Drake. Oh, no. It does recognize the Quantanium, so that's good. And it does recognize the gold, which is good. Only 7k for the gold, but it only recognizes... It only recognizes the cargo grid of these, which is 10. It's 154k, meaning it, it doesn't recognize the rest of them. So, ah, it won't let me sell what's in the hoppers, which is about another 10, which is about another 150. Interesting. Which means... Wait, they don't sell scrap here, all right. Four hundred unit for iron's not worth it. Fifteen k for that. Twenty five k for that. Hmm, nice. The Taranite, Quantanium, Epstein, and Bexalite—they're the four that you get from um, either the big rocks or out on the. Asteroids. Laminite, diamonds, corridor and beryl, tungsten, titanium, gold, grecium, iodine, fluoride, boron, acetane, hydrogen, lots of stuff. you got to figure out what's good and what's bad. All right. Speaking of what's good and what's bad... I sadly have to go back. That is a little bit sad. And grab those boxes. Once I've got my... I tell you what though, once we've got our own hangar, and our hangars are... Um, persistent. At that point, it's going to be a lot better. 
because then what we can do is we can just leave the boxes in our hangar. The problem I've got now is this is so frustrating. I've got to go back to the ship. I, I kind of want to test something quickly before I end this video. I want to test something. Wait. Okay. Gotta wait for the train. I want to... So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go back and I'm going to go back into the vulture. Wait, that's going to Tobin Center? I don't... I don't I don't want to go to Tobin Center. Weird. Spire Grand. I don't want to go there. I want to go Spaceport. It's fixed itself. I was able to sell everything that was in the back, even if it wasn't on the cargo grid. That's fine. Hold on a minute. It sold... I sold 10. I'm sure I had 12. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. Yeah, I did only have 10, didn't I? I didn't. I could have got a lot more out. Could have filled them all up. I can do. T I can do 20. In the back, plus any cargo I take from the ship. Yeah, two runs. Two full runs. But then I can also fill up the hopper for a third run. That'll be okay in a hangar. I need to test this. I'm going to go back and forth, but I need to test this. So what I want to know is if I put a box on the hangar floor and leave it there, can I sell it? Nearing next stop. It's going to be an interesting test. We have got 300k, so I guess. In terms of profit, we made 200k profit in an hour and a half. Because we have to go back and empty the other one, so yeah. 200k profit, hour and a half. That's not terrible. It's not great. I still think at this stage gold is the most profitable thing to do, but on the live server, you may may struggle, possibly struggle, um, to fill those orders. Right, we're not actually going to take off. We don't want to get a fine either, though. that's the only problem. My ramp. Oh, that's weird. I'm going this way instead. Okay. Strange. 
don't actually want to take off. Let's go. That is weird. I can't. That is weird. Okay. I don't know if that counts. There's only going to be nine here in total. First four is there. Two more to go. I wonder if I can sell eight or nine. Okay, that's it. So there's eight there, plus one there. Go back and see how many I can sell. Can I sell eight or nine? I'm not worried about the last one. For the sake of this test. Just be interesting to know how many I can sell. Because if I can sell nine, that means I can next time... Four. Uh, if I can sell nine, then that means that I don't have to do two trips. I can just dump a load on the floor, print a load out, and I get back, and then sell them all in one go, which is what I'm hoping for, without getting any fines. Server's laggy, though. Okay, let's try this. And then we're done. Capsule now approaching station. Stand clear of disembarking passengers. I mean, even gold, really, it's not worth... You're only getting like 7k for the gold, whereas you're getting 15k for an SKU, an SCU of RMC. So, the only... The only thing that's worth taking out of cargo is Quantanium. Nothing else is worth it.
I think you can do three ships though. Do the first ship, put it out, that's ten. Plus any cargo you get on the free. Let's say you get six cargo. That's sixteen. Plus the next ten, which stays in the hopper. Plus the next ten. It's twenty-six in the box, ten in the hopper, three spare. Yeah. Easy, easy free. Then you spend 150 and you get back at least 450 at least means you're making 300k profit and if you can do that in I don't know you need to do it in an hour really to make it any good but I think it's going to be more like an hour and a half. It's about 30 minutes a job. Plus all the mucking about back and forth. I mean, it's an hour and a half now and I've only done two jobs. Eight or nine. Eight or nine. Eight. Okay. Eight it is, but is there going to be one in New Babbage? No, does not recognize it. Okay, good to know. Good to know. All right, we lost one. It's fine, it happens. All right. 200k profit ish but that is good news we're back up to 323k again so you know that's not terrible and we can continue with more offers we've still got these 50k contracts which are the biggest ones they do but I guess we just have to look at what's out there probably not the best contract to do in this area maybe we go and have a look here there's a Constellation Aquila, okay. That's in crew. The Vanguard Sentinel again. Probably not worth doing that one. You have to kind of decide what you're going to do, right? There should be four. There's a Vanguard Hoplite, Horus Constellation. That's the first two. Another Vanguard there. There should be one more. Should be one more 50, but there's not. Interesting. Thought it would have been four of them, one for each, one for each location. Oh, only three. Okay. But because we're getting these jobs now because we've maxed this out and this is Adagio Holdings it says hmm we got that one we got that one that's it more will come on in a minute I'm sure of it. They're not the best of ships, though. We can also do the unverified contracts now. 100k? <sighs> wow. Fortune has shined upon us once again. Huh. 
200k for that one though that's crazy this is the one where you have to go and uh, scrub the ID nice clean up job but these ones here 100k that's crazy Argo Mole wow big job big job so that'll be the next thing we'll have to do is the unverified jobs and take a whole career path down that road. But for now, in terms of what we're doing here, that's it. We've bought a ship. We've got 300k in profit. So thinking about what do we do next? Um, reputation. It'll obviously be one we want to build up. And that's something that will take time. There is no, uh, which is interesting as well. Huh. Security hasn't moved. And there is nothing. Wow, there is nothing at all on this. So if we go to, at the moment, salvage missions. Dajo Holdings. There's no... There's no, nothing here for them. Yeah. Nope, nothing for them at all. So there's no there's no rep system. So you just take the contracts and off you go. But it's the 50Ks you're looking for. The Vanguard don't really want to do that one. They will keep showing up. Got to kind of find the best ones to do. But uh, I think for now that's it. We've kind of set out and done everything we wanted to do. Now, we can just buy some better ships. I'd like to get back into trading. Get a Hercules. Maybe we'll get the hull. Get the hull uh, C. That will be nice and fun to play with. But overall, in terms of this beginner's guide, uh, it concludes here. So thank you so much. And as soon as the next patch is out, I will create another one for you. But for now, take care. Thank you very much for your time. And uh, I'll speak to you soon. Look after yourself. Bye-bye.